Hey everyone and welcome back to the channel. So in today's video, I'll be teaching you guys how to properly cancel your domain or registered website under GoDaddy and get a full refund from their platform. So without further ado, let's dive right in. So to actually do this is quite simple. And um, basically what we're doing here is we're requesting a refund from GoDaddy, basically appealing to them saying that uh, we did not get the uh, experience or the features that we were looking for using their platform. So uh, they should issue us and we want to issue a refund. So to do it is quite simple. And assuming that you guys have are already logged into your GoDaddy account, you'd want to uh, navigate to the top right corner of your screen and look for the billing tab. So I believe it was um, renewal and, oh yes. So it's this one right here, renewals and billing. So when we go to click on it, uh, it'll redirect us to this page where it'll pull up all of our registered domains and websites. So as you guys can see here, uh, these two uh, these two websites that I have are free trials. So there's actually no way to cancel the payment for them <clears throat> or request a refund. But basically, the steps remain the same. So under the subscriptions tab, you guys will want to highlight the uh, domain or website that you want to cancel and request a refund for. And the way to do it is you either highlight them like so, and then select one of these options here, or you could manually select each one of them by clicking on the ellipses or the three dots next to the corresponding uh, domain or website. And there should be an option below, turn off auto renew to uh, cancel subscription and request a refund. So you guys simply want to click on that, send them a, uh, a submission, or I should say an application to cancel your domain and they'll basically work their magic to cancel it and possibly give you a refund, assuming that all of your um, conditions or all of your reasons are valid. And when you do uh, and they approve your request, the money should be back in your, or I should say the payment uh, gateway that you use to pay for GoDaddy. And yeah, it's honestly just that. So uh, hopefully this video will help you guys out. And if it did, be sure to let us know down in the comment section below. And yeah, thank you all for watching. We'll see you guys in the next one. Bye-bye.